What's going on everybody? It's your buddy Ben, aka the Fat Kid Deuce, and today I've got a fun little video to share with you. We're gonna take a four by four inch pieces of artwork that we've purchased, and some that have been given to us as we've traveled, and we're gonna turn them into necklaces or pendants that you could actually wear around your neck, maybe pair them with a cool outfit. For this, really you just need something to make a necklace out of. So I've got round leather cord, we'll see how that works. And then you also need a fixture or a loop to pass the cord or the necklace through, right? So I picked up a variety of screw eyelets and then I've also got some glue on balls. Yeah, so let's get right to it. What do you say? So we're gonna start with this attractive little piece right here. I picked this up when I was in Michigan uh, recently. Um, a young lady by the name of Cats Her Creations. Let me get my finger off of her, her stuff. Yeah, so she's a little bit of an artist. I picked up a nice little glass bead that I'm wearing around my neck right now. And then uh, this little ditty well, that we're also gonna turn into something. So, we're just gonna use super glue. As you can see, it's been kind of stapled on the back. We'll just take our glue on ball eyelets, pop that open, yeah. We'll use two of them. You literally could probably get away with just one, but we're gonna use two because one is a lonely number and I want I want the eyelet to have a little friend, you know? And maybe it'll make it a little bit more stable. All right, so we're gonna go kind of towards the top here. Are these identical? So we're gonna take these and see if we can them on just like that, okay. And then there you go, you see that is securing right like that. Bada boom, bada boom. We're just gonna take a bit of this leather cord, stretch it out a little bit, so. We're gonna cut about 18 inches maybe? 18, 20 inches? I don't know. I mean, if it's too long, you can always take off more. And then we'll just go ahead and fit it through. I'm gonna tie just a square knot. You could get really crazy with these. Tie a bow on the hitch if you want it. So I'm just gonna square knot it up. And as you can see, your piece of artwork is now a pendant. Beautiful. Let's do our other one. So with this one, it's pretty much kind of the same, but the way the uh, canvas was attached is a little bit different. It looks like it was glued, which means that we've got this, this wonderful, this wonderful wood that maybe we can just screw a couple of eyelets into and then that'll be all we really need. I got this at the Lost Lands Free Union in 2021. Sadly, I can't make out this ink down here, so uh, just thank you to the person who gave this to me for picking up trash. Yes, I do that a lot. Um, so we have different eyelets here, three different kinds. I really went nuts, 180 pieces. I think we're gonna do, I think we're gonna do this bronze, copperish looking color. I mean, I like the gold, no, those are cool, but yeah, another, the, another project. Okay, we really only need like two of them. Oh, oh, damn, it's way really more than I need. All right, here we go. And then literally, so it's kind of difficult to do. We're really gonna have to put some pressure on it and keep it going downwards or else it just doesn't really want to start. Um, I probably could have measured this one better too. 
but it is what it is. We're, we're at we're where we are now in life, and we'll just be happy with that, okay? So I've got one right about there. Maybe I'll do the other one, like maybe right about there. So that way it kind of hangs straight on the neck. Get in there and really muscle it. Muscle. You could probably hold this in your hand, like close to your chest, and really just put a little extra effort in there. It'll probably work a lot better. So and there we go. And then we'll go ahead and measure out another length of this cord. Yeah. And then we'll go ahead and see the thing. Yes, the loops are big enough. I thought the cord might be a little bit too thick. A double square knot. Is that what I'm about to do? Yeah, I did it. I freaking did it. Pair of pliers might be nice for this. Yeah. And there you go. You've got another pendant. And we didn't even have to use any glue. And then it's kind of cool because like you're a walking exhibition hall. Matter of fact, it might be a little bit of a conversation start. Somebody walks up and you're like, boy, that's a really cool piece of artwork. Where'd you get that? You just look them in the eye and you say, cats are creations, buddy. You can get one yourself. She's just over there selling that stuff. Yeah, pretty cool, huh? That's how you take a piece of artwork and turn it into a pendant. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you find this video helpful. God bless. Later.